basic research at Jackson Laboratory is just as important to medicine as nuclear fission was to the atomic bomb. Jax has always been known as a mouse institute, and so when I tell people I work at Jax, they think, oh, you guys are the mice guys, but we're really the genetics guys. Genomic medicine is very much like detective work. If you're trying to solve a crime, you don't just focus on one individual, you look at who they associate with as well. We do the same thing. We start with a gene that we think is contributing to a common birth defect. So we've come up with a list of genes that always seems to be associated with CDH, but these guys have never actually been implicated. They've never been charged with the crime. In the case of a gene called PBX1, I can then work with my colleagues and design a mouse that we intentionally turn this gene off. And sure enough, there's the defect in the same place that you would expect that defect in a human. And so we got a new suspect, right? We have somebody that we can now implicate, that we can convict then maybe we can prevent the birth defect from happening in the first place. 